everyone, we're back. Finally. Yeah, we <laughs> had a bit of a bout with uh, the remote. Again. It's Turns out the true horror of Silent Hill was the TV remote. Yeah, as soon as I get a replacement, I've been looking at uh, the fancy Logitech Harmony son of a bitch. Logitech makes a good uh, universal remote. My stepdad's got one with a touch screen. Yeah, I'm going to buy one of those. only like 100 bucks, and I'm going to put this one that came with the TV in the blender. It got, uh, it got childrened by a small child, but it's, um, <laughs> it's a good product. <laughs> it got children? It got children. What did McKenna do to it? Uh, she dropped it on the tile floor, and it shattered oh. the touch screen. Ah. Uh, yeah, it got children. But, you know. It stood up as well. What are you doing? I'll hold it. We're, we're Man, we're recording. Just, he's about to crack ass in the recording studio. Oh, I don't want to. Oh, I hate holding it. I hate it. Man. I held it. Thank you. That's right. You've had fucking dumpster farts for three <laughs> days. We went to Waffle House. Oh, yeah. You know, I fucking checked this last time. You'd think I'd remember. We went to Waffle House, and I had a triple plate of hash browns all the way with gravy and chili. Jesus. And it, That was Saturday night. And it wasn't, that wasn't Saturday, that was Thursday night. Was it really Thursday night? Yeah, because I had to get up and go to work in the morning, and I drug ass all morning because I'd stayed out too late. Dude. That was days ago, and your ass is still making that smell. <sighs> you need to go to the doctor. <laughs> you see that doctor? <laughs> you, did you see that doctor yet? <laughs> Damn. That's a long running joke. Funny guy at work. Fuck. Do you see that doctor yet? You see, just, hey, do you see that doctor yet? <laughs> Who's in there? Um, uh, that smells awful. You need to see a doctor. <laughs> oh. <laughs> and then just days later, just in the hallway, just, hey, do you see that doctor yet? <laughs> With a smile on his face the whole time, just, hey, did you see that doctor yet? That was bad. <laughs> I'm concerned for your health. Yeah, man. Because you smell like a dead person. <laughs> you smell like someone who has died and is now farting. Fuck you, skin bat. It doesn't smell like a bad fart. It smells like the last fart. It smells like the last fart. I wonder if I can go in here. Fucking no. I wouldn't look at that place. Well, let's be honest. If it was me, I would have like hurled myself down one of these giant chasms like <laughs> minute one. No, you wouldn't. You'd have shot yourself. You're afraid of heights. That is true. Because of those options, uh, shooting myself seems like the least terrifying option. Yeah. Nah, I'd probably go get mauled by skin dogs. That can't uh, take that long. Oh, dude, getting... Oh, no. Awful. Jesus. Hey, what's down here? You gonna die? Come oh, on. I'm gonna die. Nope. Oh, oh! Dodged! Come back around. What's the matter, Red? Jesus, Harry, I can shoot, but... Oh, ammo. Now, man, Harry Mason is a writer. No, he ain't gone. He's coming back. And I work in an office. I've already wasted two shots on him. i got to put the third in him. Uh-oh. Hmm. i got to figure out what the crackling means. Where are we? Hmm. Um, we're we're in the alley between Eleven and Bachman Street. What's that thing the, at the end of the end of the alley? Chain sales. I think I can zoom in somehow. There we go. Oh, oh well, thank you. <laughs> it's got a cut right chainsaws. Can you get a chainsaw? We'll find out. Are you going the right way? No. I'm going, like, backwards. What's with the fucking... crack a -lacking. Yeah, I don't, I don't like the crack a -lacking. Jesus! Come on, camera. <laughs> Camera's like, nah. Nah, bro. Shit, man. <laughs> huh. Alright, there ain't nothing down here. It's Normally, a... alleyways got, like, shit hidden in them, you know? Oh, oh, here we go. It's combat time. Yeah, I hear you. Do you? I think the crackling means like two guys. <gasps> I 
Good. Hate you. Come on, come on, stomp it. Yeah. Squeak. Okay then. Poor little squeak. Poor little squeak, squeak. <laughs> okay. Okay. Wish I could just, wish I could just tape down L two. Keep the camera behind me at all times. <laughs> I guess you could. Get, well, there's a rubber, there's a rubber band in the house somewhere. Oh. Where is it? I don't know. The draw distance goes like twelve feet. It's coming from this way, I believe. The directional sound is okay, actually. Yeah. Oh, skin dog. You ever heard of the movie Plague Dogs? Motherfucker. Get down. Plague Dogs? Yeah. No, I have not. Um, you ever seen <clears throat> You ever seen uh, the Rats of Nim? Uh-uh. Is this cut right chainsaws? Oh. What do you mean there's no gasoline can't use it? Bring it anyway. Where the hell do I find gasoline? At the gas station. Oh, dude, I'm going to get gasoline and give me a fucking chainsaw. And it's going to be on like Donkey Kong. Actually, if I remember right, I think the chainsaw is like a new game plus item. I think you find gasoline later on when you can't come back here. And the only way to get that is if you, like, play through again. Ah. Uh. I might be wrong about that. You want to look that up real quick, see if I'm making that shit up? Because if we pass up a chainsaw, I'm going to be real upset. There's a gas station on the corner. While you're doing that, I'm just going to go check it out. Because we got to pass by the church. And church, as we all know, is where we're headed. Up. Oh. Fucking jingle monsters. <laughs> jingle monsters. Yeah, man, it's jingle monsters. Not Wells Fargo. Oh, it's like, it. it's snowing. Apparently there's no parking in Silent Hill. Because all these signs say no parking anytime. Piss. No parking. Kill it! Kill it! Yeah. Um, we at the gas station? Change. We are. Silent. Hey, gas station. Bill. Where your gas at? What the hell kind of evil ass gas station is this? Oh, it's <laughs> supposed to be like a shell or something, I guess. It's like fucking Cthulhu brand gasoline. <laughs> Miskatonic brand gas. Let me in. Damn it. The Silent Hill Wookie is loading slow as balls. Come on, Silent Hill. You've got this place listed on the map. You gotta let me in. Uh, you must complete the game at least once to unlock the gasoline yeah, tank. Yeah, that's what I figured. Okay, well, we check that out. Cool. I like that he can hit it flying through the air at him, but not while it's just fucking doodling around all, all the way over there. Yeah. Harry's abilities seem to be a bit random. Hey, ammunition. <clears throat> Thank you. And yeah. some boss killing rounds. How much, uh, how much comes in a box of shotgun shells in this game? Ten? Six, I believe. That's lame. In real life, a box of shotgun shells is 25. Yeah. Well, the shotgun in this game is, like, stupid powerful. Well, in real life, a shotgun is stupid powerful. At close range, right? Um, at fair range. Mm. Depending on what you're shooting out of it. I mean, bird shot is not effective <coughs> to kill anything other than birds. I see. Well, I guess we should just uh, go to the church, then, unless you want to, like, come check out the bridge control room over here. I uh, doubt we can do anything with it. Ooh, hey. Hello. What's that? Hey, Shotgun health. shells, first of all. And health kit. Oh, is that what that is? I thought it was a note. Yeah. Pass. <laughs> Rewarding exploration. That's good game design. I remember we were playing something and you worked really hard. It was when we were playing Borderlands, it was some area you worked really hard to get to something and then got mad because you thought you were going to get something. Yeah, and then there was nothing there because that's bullshit. If you have made an area that's really difficult to get somewhere and then you don't reward the players for getting there, that's bad game design. So hey. take, take note, all you AAA game designers watching our show. Yeah, all, all <laughs> like none of you. Oh, good. There's another area that we have not gotten to yet. Cool. But now i got a map for it. Uh, uh, before I save, I'm going to check this place out. Hey, health, health drink. Health drink. <clears throat> I would have just moved in here. 
Yeah. There's keyhole on the payment panel. You gotta find a key. Yeah. Something yeah. tells me we gotta go do our little tiddly bit in the church first. It's defensible. It's second floor. It's small. It's perfect. But once they know you're here, you fucking slip in there and you fucking get down and you be quiet. <clears throat> Good place to sleep. Yeah. That's where my brain would go. Anyway. Yeah, but he's after his daughter. Yeah. You know. And people with kids. Now, man. Nah. You'd go like, you'd go save your dad. Well, yeah. See? It's like that, but with kids. I guess. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'd go save family, but kids aren't family. They're kids. Yeah, I guess oh. it's one of those abstractions. You don't under, It's one of those things like the parents, you don't understand until you have them. Uh. Yeah, because your brain has been changed by like parasitic chemistry. <clears throat> the child has taken over your mind. I've lost Facebook friends like that. <laughs> you wouldn't understand. You don't have children of your own. That's like telling me I don't understand the pain of tapeworms because I don't have one. I can grasp an abstract concept. I'm I'm like a people with a frontal lobe, remember? You fucker. It's like telling me I don't understand heroin addiction because I've never tried it. No, I understand. You have a physical need for it. I can, I can understand that in abstract sense with people. Are you all prepared for a lot of story? No. Who's that guy? That's Jesus. That's no. my homeboy. He works for our company. No, man, that's Jesus. Oh. That is Gillespie. <laughs> I have never seen this far into this Were game. Were you ringing that bell? There's a lot of heavy shit going I've on right here. I've been expecting you. It was foretold by gyromancy. What? What are you talking about? I knew you'd come. It was foretold. You the girl, right? Don't we all? The girl? You're talking about Cheryl. Cheryl? Meryl. Everything. <laughs> you know something? Tell me. You better tell me right now, Frank. Nothing is to be gained from floundering about at random. How about a fucking cap you you us? Follow the path. You're gonna follow my path. Follow right into the ground. By Flowros. Flowros, what? man. Of what? About. This is probably the most genuine set of reactions he gives in the game. Flowers, a cage of peace. It can break through the walls of darkness and counteract the wrath of the underworld. The flowers, man. Make haste to the hospital before it's too late. Hey, we get to go to a hospital. Oh, good. Wait, don't go yet. Don't go yet. School, hospital. Now all we need is a shopping mall. And we can get all the stereotypical horror settings out of the way. Also, well, a prison. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. Something tells me Silent Hill didn't have a prison. There is a flowros. Take it. Well, yeah. Apparently it's a cage of peace. Get that key. Oh, hey look. Drawbridge key. Cool. Guess we're going across the bridge now. Yes. I'm really liking that I don't have to play this game. I'm really liking that I got to play it. Because it, it really is conquering an old beast for me. Um, Hi, Catholic here. We don't have creepy ass paintings in our uh, in our churches anymore. <laughs> anymore? Yeah, it's more of an Eastern Orthodox thing. Because they're into the whole I icon thing. Ico iconography? I iconography, yes. Ooh, health drink. A... <coughs> Oh, sorry, guys. Blessings of the Mad God, oh, sir. Oh, man. Y you okay over there? No, I tried to cautious sneeze, and now it feels like I exploded my brain. You you might have. Yeah, you, you can die. People have actually had strokes and died. Hey, save point. Hey. People have actually had strokes and died from doing that. Yeah, don't do not do that, man. Just fucking have an aneurysm and drop dead. <laughs> Just, all right, I guess, uh... I guess Balcony Bros is over since one of us is dead. I uh, guess it could just be Balcony Bro. Um, if one of us dies on the channel, um, I say the other person either can't release it or has to release it. I haven't decided which yet. Has to release it. 
Must be locked from the other side. That's the bathroom. That's <laughs> where you go take a holy shit. <laughs> <laughs> also, what kind of pews are those? Did they have seats? They look flat. They might be kneeling pews. Um, I don't. I don't know that that's like a thing anymore. I don't know if it was ever a thing. Um, I've been in a Catholic church I'm once. I mean, my skin hurt real bad when I was in there. It burny, itchy feeling. No, man, you've been in a Catholic <laughs> church several times. I've seen it. Anyway, um, it was like a where was I? And they had in front of the pews. It was like a thing that folded out, uh-huh. so you could kneel down. Yeah, it's called a kneeler. Yeah. They don't put them in the dumbass contemporary style church. I don't like it. Because sometimes you want to kneel down, and a lot of people it's traditional that they do so at certain times. And if you don't have a kneeler, you just got to kneel on the floor, and it sucks. But if you got that kneeler thing, they put, like, seriously three inches of padding on that thing. It's like kneeling on a fucking cloud. Yeah. It's like kneeling on a cloud. (laughs) It should be solid wood. Solid wood and with little nubs on it. And you got to grind your knees across it for penance. Because Jesus is pain. Sorry I'm saving so much, everybody. I'm a poon. (laughs) No, it's it's good for me. I'm down with it. Somebody said that we should talk to our audience less. They said it feels needy. Oh, I guess I should, like, use the key. Um, yeah. We're mostly talking to each other. Yeah, oh. Go ahead and use that. Why should I have to tell you to use a damn drawbridge key? Um, yes. And cue sirens. I don't know. Maybe. Anyway. Yeah, I mean, we're mostly talking to each other, but, you know, it's, uh... A lot of people address their audiences. I don't know. I'm not really sure how to think about it, you know? We're presenting. Also, I thought of a name. I've already used it on the Facebook page, so I hope you agree with it. But I called our audience the Balconeers. What do you think? Eh, eh, it's okay. I'm not against it. Let me know if you think of something better. Yeah, uh, there's a health drink. If you guys think of anything better, let me know. Does the fan base name itself? Um, I know nobody came up with fucking Whovians. I hate that word. It's a dumbass I hate that fucking show. Not to get us less people that like us, but fuck Doctor Who. I'm... I try... Me tries it, see? I think it fucking sucks. I've seen it with David Tennant. I've seen it with the Smith. Yeah, Matt Smith. I didn't like either of them. I thought they both sucked. I thought it was a fan service hokey piece of shit. I didn't like it. And the only reason I'm being so, like, full of vitriol is that anytime I've been, like, tried to tell somebody that likes the show, eh, it wasn't really for me, they get angry at me and, like, get in my face about that show. So fuck that show. You don't understand the artistic... Oh, piss. Was that skin bat? I didn't see Hey, it. police station. So that's Guess really the only on. reason I'm so opposed to Doctor Who is because the people that are into it have been such cocks to me. I don't like it. And their attitude has made me like it less. Come on, motherfucker. Come on, bitch. You don't get some. Shit. <laughs> Piss. <laughs> How'd you fucking circle around me, you bastard? You bastard. This is worse than the fucking cliff racers. Yeah, it really is, man. It's The combat in this game is absolute shit. but It's meant to be. Yeah. Sort of. At this least, was a little. this was kind of back when they were still trying to figure that shit out. You know, they didn't know that a game shouldn't be hard because its controls are shit. Can I go in the police station? The lock is jammed. Great. Of course it is. Obviously. Oh, God damn it! Let it be a dog. I can handle dogs. I'm tired of the fucking skin bats. What the hell is that? That was new. Shoot it! What Piss! The, what was that, dude? What the fuck is that? Fucking oh. monkey thing. Ooh. Yes, let me in. I wonder if, uh, what's her name's in here? 
Who? The police officer lady from the beginning. Oh, yeah, Sybil. We're going to the hospital. I wonder if we even need to be here. Or if we can, like, get anything. There ought to be guns and shit in here. That's what you do. Oh, shotguns. That's what you do in a police station, right? You have guns? Um, you see, a lot of police officers aren't very good shots. Really? Yeah, because they only have to qualify once a year, and most of them only ever shoot that once a year. Most police officers aren't really into guns. Well, I mean, I I guess that's a good idea. Why is there a save point here? Well, Man, they give you save things like every five feet in this. Maybe that's a an easy mode thing. Very possibly. But yeah, I forgot we were playing an easy mode, but I'm not... There's a memo on the desk. Coroner Seals called Officer Gu <laughs> Officer Gucci. <laughs> <laughs> kiss, Offi kiss from a rose <laughs> uh, Officer Gucci and uh, Kiss from a rose Yeah cause it was Coroner Seals I killed him oh, He's dead <laughs> man. Officer Gucci and Officer Louis Vuitton Were with <laughs> Officer Coach <laughs> Fucking uh, uh, Burberry yeah, Officer Burberry Captain Burberry <laughs> Captain Burberry <laughs> Officer Gucci is unlikely to be murdered. He apparently died naturally. But medical records show Officer Gucci had no prior... <laughs> Officer G had no prior symptoms of heart disease. Did you, did you well, you don't need to have any... Did you piss all over your Gucci's there? Oh, God. We played D&D &D with a guy. Um, it's so funny. Like, his character was just fucking ridiculous. There's something on it. Product only available in selected areas of Silent Hill for a limited time, as seen on TV by Ronco. This is the pocket Order fisherman. No. <laughs> Raw material is white Claudia, a plant per a peculiar to the region. Manufactured here? Dealer equals manufacturer? Oh, it's some kind of drug. Cool. Huh. I like drugs. Yeah, I bet you do. <laughs> you goddamn pothead. <laughs> you on them reefers, boy? You smoking that dope, damn old hippies? Why the hell would they give us a save point here? There's like two rooms in the police station. But no, there's, there's no drugs here. Officer. Oh, <laughs> uh, 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 it's, no, it's not, it's not, uh, it's not like that. Piss. I wonder if we can like escape the, the ape things. Can you go down Crichton Street or you gotta go down Wilson? Uh, let's give it a shot. Go, go, go. We're on Sagan Street. Carl Sagan? Yeah. Sweet. Also Crichton. But oh that's right, you don't Michael know. Crichton. Uh, yeah. Jurassic Park. I was gonna say Crichton from uh Red Dwarf. Nah no, I don't He's not into Red Dwarf and that's fine. I really like that show. I sincerely doubt anybody under the age of like forty five is into Red Dwarf. Um that's not true. Two point I was. Oh uh, yeah. I found somebody else that shares my interest in a really old British TV show. Yeah, and uh, the fact that 2.0 likes that makes it cool now. <coughs> Sorry, man, your tastes are questionable, but he shares the name of a genius. <laughs> he fucking... <laughs> damn it, man. <laughs> Come on, man. That's not, not funny. That's, that's funny, man. <laughs> my okay, taste, so we can't... My taste is unquestionable. I only like good things. Can't go any farther that way. Oh, good. The hospital's right here. Yeah, well, that's where we're headed. Let's, let's go. go to the post office. Let no, let's go to the hospital. Come on, man. I want to check for supplies in the post office. It's right here. Not that that means anything. Seriously, you put like a big fucking pink square, made it colored on the map, and I can't go in it? Yep. Dicks. You bastards. Oh, hey. There's got to be something up here. Well, yeah. There ain't been no other stairs. Oh, and it loaded a new area. Mm. <laughs> Just blank. Nothing. Oh, here's how you get in. Clock is jammed. Yep, it opens up later. There's a lot of damn jammed locks in Silent Hill. A lot of fucked up doors. Somebody came around with a sledge and was just hammering nails into stuff. A fucking bottle of super glue. <laughs> really? Nothing, huh? Hmm. You bastards. Um, come back to questionable taste. What uh, what's your guilty pleasure for as far as like 
media consumption goes? Um, animes very specifically like um the slice of life kind. Well, they've got a name for them. I don't know what it is. Um, in Japan, whenever they make an anime or a show in general or like a a comic or something, they have names for them for like who they're targeted towards. Like Shonen. You remember Shonen Jump when we were kids? Oh shit. Fuck you. Fuck. Damn it. Dick. Yeah. All right. Um. Anyway, um there was a thing that came out. I bought them all the time when I was a kid. And uh but it was a bunch of like compiled uh mangas, like anime comics. Mhm. And uh, it was called Shonen Jump. And Shonen is the genre that's targeted towards like adolescent boys, I guess. Shit that's cool for like the 12 year old kids, you know? So like Dragon Ball Z was in there. Fucking uh, One Piece was in there before it became a big anime hit. Shaman King. All the like Pokemon, Yu Gi Oh shit. And I am, I mean, I like that stuff. I like all, well, not all anime, but I'm a big fan of, like, I guess what you would call the the opposite of that, the one that would be targeted towards girls. The slice of life. Oh, piss. Did you hear that? Yeah. Like the school drama, dramedy sort of thing? Yeah. I mean, not kind of the drama, but mostly just the funny comedy stuff. Like, Azumanga Dayo, I think is hilarious. It's just a bunch of schoolgirls. Well, I mean, there's guys there too, but it's mostly targeted on the little group of girls going around just having dumbass adventures. Like, ha ha, you know, they they want to swim, but we don't want to swim. Whatever. It's funny. The fact that Chio Chan has a dog named Mr. Tadakichi is hilarious mm, to me. <laughs> Mr. Tadakichi. Mr. Tadakichi. <laughs> Does he bite? No. Mr. Tadakichi is a perfect gentleman. <laughs> and that, uh,. What the hell's her name? Sasaki is like the tall, stoic, athletic, badass chick, but is obsessed with cute shit secretly. <laughs> it's funny. Yeah. Not really my thing, but I got gotcha. you. That is my guilty pleasure. I have gotten a whole lot better. Oh, at piss. Another uh, cutscene. What the fuck is it? Oh, that's what the bang was. Oh. Agent Mulder? Dude, it's Fox Mulder. Is your, uh, your partner around here? Hold it. Whoa. Man, you're a shitty shot. Stop. Don't shoot. What is that shit? You already shot. Wait. I'm not here to fight. My name is Harry Mason. I'm in town on vacation. What do you got? Blanks in that thing? He's going to say. Thank God. Another human being. Do you work here? How do you miss somebody from three feet? I'm Dr. Michael Kaufman. I work at this hospital. And apparently I shoot ghost so maybe bullets. maybe you can tell me what's going on. I really can't say. the hell is this music? Look, Look at his neck. His hair is part of his neck. When I woke up, it was like this. <laughs> Both of them. Everyone seems to have disappeared. <laughs> and it's snowing up this time of year. <laughs> They're both fucking humpbacks. Something's gone seriously wrong. He's a tiny man. Did Harry is taller than him. Have you ever seen such aberrations? I'm glad somebody's finally referencing them. Heard of such things? You and I both know creatures like that don't exist. Harry's just like, yeah, I was just not thinking about it. I was doing a damn good job of not thinking about it until you Have brought you it seen up, a Dick. Girl anywhere? I'm looking for my daughter. She's only seven. Short. What the hell's with this music? She's missing. I'm sorry. But with all those monsters around, I highly doubt that she's. It's supposed to be tension? I don't know, man. Sorry, I didn't mean to alarm you. She's dead. She died four years ago. Now it's just me and my daughter. I see. I'm sorry. Where are you going, Doctor? <laughs> With your briefcase. I've got a train to catch. Sit around here doing nothing. So long. Good luck out there. 
Maybe we should, like, team up and, uh... Maybe get some help. There doesn't seem to be any way to get out of town. Maybe you ought to be concerned about that. Answers to these questions and more on the next edition of Balcony Brothers. God damn it. That was supposed to be the Batman, like the Justice League. Da -da 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 -da. Yeah. yeah. It was supposed to be that. Maybe we can edit that in. We won't. No. We're just going to leave me being fucking dumb. All right. Yeah. But we are going to go out to the lobby. Yeah, we are. On the next episode, we'll uh, explore this spooky Duke hospital. Oh, good. Yeah. Get excited. We'll see you guys next episode. Bye, y'all. Bye. Bye.